Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have for you the highly anticipated Chanel holiday gift sets. I picked some of these up in store and then some of them are also on the way to me, but I wanted to show you how to convert them to a shoulder bag and how they compare to last year's because they are very similar, but with some differences. So first of all, look, this is the new holiday Chanel packaging with the red, it looks like a tweed camellia. So I have three of them for you right now. I have a few more on the way. I pick up a few of these because I send them back home to my family in the Philippines. But these are great gift sets because they're so affordable. And then the cosmetic pouch that it's packaged in can be converted to a bag, like a shoulder bag, which I will show you how to do in a second. I did a video on this last year and some of you have been asking for when they will be restocked. So if you've been waiting to order these, follow me on Instagram, it's at a heated mess. Anytime there is a great deal or with these Chanel sets that sell out really fast, the pre-orders have already been online and they've sold out and they were available again and then they sold out. I always post restocks and turn on your notifications so you don't miss them. But this is the packaging, the outside packaging. And can we just appreciate the holiday decor? <laughs> the holiday packaging, this is the red, it's like a tweed camellia. They have red and pink ribbons. But before we get into the holiday sets, I wanted to really quick show you the holiday collection that Chanel put out this year. I didn't get everything. I got a few things. And then when I went and sort of pick up these sets, I ended up getting some more. If you have been following my channel for a while, you may have known that I recently unboxed the Chanel number no. five calendar and it was their first like advent calendar. That's it back there. It was, I would categorize it as a disaster an $825 plus tax fraud. <laughs> the products that it contains definitely is not worth $825. And as you watch the video, you can hear my disappointment. It really is for a Chanel collector and just someone who loves Chanel and doesn't care about value or money. <laughs> so in honor of Chanel number no. five perfume, they also released a limited edition eyeshadow palette. So this is the packaging. It's an eyeshadow quad. It comes in a velvet pouch. This is the outside and these are what the eyeshadows look like. And you can see it is a very special Chanel number no. five stamping on the eyeshadow colors. I don't want to swatch this because I'm considering getting another one. <laughs> like as a keepsake, whatever. If you love Chanel number no. five, you would get two of these, I think, because I just don't want to mess up the, I just don't want to mess up the pan, right? It's just so special. And then I just couldn't resist. I also picked up the Balm Essential. It's like a highlighting stick. It's gold this year. The color is Ore. I just like highlighting sticks because it is very... Okay, so there it is. See, it's just like this glistening, gorgeous cream highlighter. And then I got the liquid eyeshadow in the color Ore Noir, which is like gold black. And I don't know if you can really pick it up here, but it's this really pretty black. It's like a gunmetal black, and then it has these gold specks in them. So this is it. So you can see it's very sparkly. I actually am wearing it as an eyeliner today. But yeah, that's how I would wear it. I wouldn't wear it as an eyeshadow, like all over, but I would wear it as an eyeliner. And then I got the number no. five Lo. And even though I already own this from the Factory Five collection, I got this because it's this limited edition packaging. This CC is has like a wax seal and this is on an elastic and you can use this to keep this around the case for decoration or around the bottle. And then the bottle itself has a limited edition packaging. And this is the usual label number five look. Okay, so back to the gift sets. I have three here. I have the moisture must-haves, eyes on mascara set, and clean slate to take the day off. Just to show you what the difference is, the packaging is very similar to last year's. So this was last year's, it's like a space stars theme. And then it's again, very similar to this year. This by the way is, is a larger size because this was the gold sublimage set that was a little more expensive, but all the other boxes are the same. So let's go ahead and unbox. Let's do the clean slate one because I think that a lot of people, I think a lot of people are kind of sleeping on this. It has this white cardboard here. And then this is the actual bag. So this is what you get. And then with the clean slate set itself, you have the eye makeup remover and the cleanser wrapped in this Chanel logo, which some of you were wondering, it does say Chanel on the tissue paper. So this is what comes packaged in here. So this is pretty, I would say this is a pretty decent size. This fits my iPhone 
12 Pro Max. And it also fits these. These are the full size eye makeup remover and the Lamousse cleansing foam. And then just to show you what it looks like compared to last year, this is the holiday bag from last year. So you can see right away that the newer set is a little more almost glittery. And this I thought was pretty glittery, but when you compare it, this one is even more so. But what's even better is this year, this is a lot softer. It's so, it's almost like a tweed finish, whereas this is very rough. And I last year I described it as kind of like a raffia material. This just seems better quality. It just seems like it's it's made better. It's softer, It's it feels nicer. This is really scratchy and some people thought it felt pretty cheap. When I showed last year how to convert this into a shoulder bag, you really had to cut the loops here on the side open because it seemed like there was like a stitching inside of it. However, this year it doesn't have that. The hooks of your chain can just kind of slip right through. The next set, this is the eyes on mascara duo set. This retails for only $66. It's even cheaper than last year. Last year, the least expensive Chanel holiday set was $72 and that was for like a lip stick and a, and a lip liner. This is $66. So this is the box, it tells you on the back, it says eyes on mascara set. And then you have this bag. And the quality is so much nicer, I think, than last year. Now this is last year's and I already have a chain on it. You can see right here, the color is a little brighter and again, it is a lot softer. Now with the red, it looks like the red was maybe a little more glittery. It looks like it has a gold metallic lining or like metallic thread underneath. Now that I'm looking at it, it really is just the material is more plasticky. <laughs> I think it's supposed to, it's trying to go for like a metallic effect. The newer version, again, it looks like it's tweed with maybe almost like a red glittery tinsel underneath. And again, if you could feel it, this is so much softer than this, which is a very rough. This is a stamped Chanel on there. So if you are rough with it, or if you scratch this, or if you rub this against something abrasive, it might come off. You know, it's not metal, it's not plastic. It really is just a stamped, almost like iron on. <laughs> It's like an iron-on transfer, like a t-shirt. The zipper pull is the same as last year. It says Chanel right there. I'll show you what's inside. So same thing, this is the Eyes On Mascara Duo. They are wrapped in the Chanel tissue paper. There's more tissue paper inside to hold the shape. The lining is very black, so it's hard to see the inside, but it's not that deep. And then there is a tag in here, I don't know if you can see it. I will sacrifice the bag to show you what the tag inside looks like. It says Chanel New York, and then the body is polyester and the lining is 100% recycled polyester. And this Chanel bag is made in China. And so you can see that I turned it inside out and it just pops right back into its shape. So this is the cosmetic pouch just on its own, but I will show you how to convert it to a bag. Now again, unlike last year, you don't need to poke holes inside the loop to attach the hook on here. It literally just kind of slides through. So you just poke it through and then there you go. So that is it on one side. So that is it with it attached on both sides. The hook on the chain goes right through. You don't need to add D-rings. You can add it if you want for like an elevated look, but I just think that adds more weight personally. Now I am pretty short, I'm five feet tall, and the best crossbody chain length for me is about 47 inches or 45 inches. I have a collab with Dress Up Your Purse and they make some great accessories, straps, tassels. The collab has a chain strap of your length and a tassel if you want to dress it up a little more. Here's a little tassel. It has a lobster clasp, and then you can just hook it right on the chain strap. This gives it a little bit a little bit of an elevated look, and then it also comes in a satin pouch, a heated mess, and a dress up your purse. So this is the regular gold chain strap. Here is a shorter, this could be like a wristlet or a very short shoulder strap. And then if you wanna dress it up a little more, they also make a leather chain strap, and this is very similar to the classic Chanel, you know, flap bag. 
I'll include the links for all these different options below. If you use my code AHEADMESS at checkout, it gives you 15% off. So these are what the two bags look like. So you have a black and then the bright red. And you can also choose different color leather if you get the red bag, a very Chanel-esque chain strap or the solid gold. And then you also have a tassel. So literally while I was filming this, I finally got my other order. So this is the Natural Touch set. This is the Neutral Naturals or Natural Touch. Look how I really like that red and I'm not a huge like red fan, <laughs> but this is a really nice red. Same pouch. Again, all these pouches are the same size. And then inside you have the nail polish and lip, like a cocoa lip balm. So you have the Verni nail polish in shade 167 Ballerina and then the Rouge Coco Bloom in shade 116 Dream. I like that the Rouge Coco Bloom has a see-through cap. That is the shade right there. Nude color, that's it right there. Very pretty. This is a great set if you just like nude colors. <laughs> that is the Natural Touch and this is $70. So this and the mascara set are the two most affordable sets. This one is 70 and then the mascara duo is 66 and they both come with this gorgeous red pouch. And then the other set is the moisture must haves. This retails for $92 and this is my favorite set. This is this was my favorite set last year and it's my favorite set again this year because this one comes with the egg hand cream and the lip balm. And I went ahead and added a shorter chain strap. So if you don't wear crossbodies or if you just wanna wear this as a wristlet and then you have yourself a gorgeous wristlet. So this is it worn as a crossbody. Again, I'm wearing <laughs> very casual clothes. This is a, this is actually a, a romper like jumpsuit by Viore. And this is it as a crossbody. So I, this one I believe is a 47 inch uh, chain strap. And then you have the tassel dangling right there. But, oh my gosh, this is so cute. And I don't have my phone on me to show you, but if you look at my video from last year, this fits everything you need. It fits your keys, it fits your wallet, it fits your phone. So this is it as a crossbody. And this is the black one with the black leather chain strap. And then I added the tassel in the front here so you can see. But yeah, so cute. Now some of you have been asking if I actually wear this and yes, I do actually wear this. I went to a friend's wedding a couple months ago and bachelorette party and I brought both colors. I actually, and I brought the gold one. The gold was from last year, it was a little bigger. But it just is so great because sometimes you just don't wanna wear these super expensive Chanel leather handbags. If you're going out, you know, if it could get dirty or if you're just running errands, it's really not that serious. So those of you who <laughs> who hate this look, you don't have to wear this as a bag. But for those of you who maybe don't wanna spend thousands of dollars on a Chanel handbag, you have a Chanel handbag with this. And I mean, that's really all that matters. Who cares what other people think? I love it and I have actual Chanel handbags. So I wear this a lot. And I will wear these new ones a lot too. Yeah, it fits a lot. So again, I mean, look how big this and eye makeup remover, this all fits. You can fit a phone, you can fit your keys, you can fit your sunglasses in here. It fits all your essentials. And you have a Chanel handbag starting at $66. So if you've been trying to get your hands on this, follow me on Instagram, at a mess. I will always post whenever these are available. And they will come out with other sets, I believe on Black Friday and then early December. The Sheer Sensation Lip Gloss Trio is not available yet. They did take pre-orders, but that won't ship until late November or early December. So stay tuned to my Instagram page if you are looking out for this and also my YouTube community page. But yeah, let me know what you think of this and let me know which set you're interested in getting this year. So I hope you enjoyed this review comparing the new Chanel holiday sets to last year's and how to convert it to a camera bag. Thanks so much for watching and I hope to catch you in my next video. Bye.